This podcast is produced by the Harwood Productions Podcast Network. To learn more about the network and to find more of our shows, visit us online at www.harwoodpodcast.com. If you like chocolate, these chocolate souffle cookies are for you. They're insanely chocolate, and they've got a nice crunchy outside with a soft brownie inside. We're going to start by melting a cup of chocolate chips. You can use either a semi-sweet or 60%. And we're going to put that in the microwave in 30 second increments as it starts to melt. Now while the chocolate's melting, we need to separate two eggs because we just need two of the egg whites. When I separate eggs, I like to do them first in one little dish. That way, in case I get a broken yolk, I haven't ruined all the other egg whites that I have separated. Let's see how our chocolate is melting. The first 30 seconds, just a little bit. Pop it back in for another 30 seconds and we start to see a little bit more melting. Let's put it in for another 30 seconds. Now, while our chocolate is melting, let's take those two egg whites, put them in the mixer with a eighth of a teaspoon of cream of tartar and we'll get that whipping up. We're gonna be looking for some soft peaks. Let's check the chocolate. It's coming along nicely, but I think another 30 seconds. After this last 30 seconds, it turns out nice and smooth. That's what we're going for. We'll just set it aside for a moment. So our egg whites look like they're at a nice soft peak which is just what we're looking for. So then what we're gonna do is get the mixture going again, and then we're gonna add a quarter of a cup of sugar to those egg whites, but just add it a little bit at a time. We want don't want the egg whites to um, deflate. So continue putting your sugar in, let that beat up, and then we're gonna be adding just a little bit of vanilla, about a quarter of a teaspoon. Now those egg whites are just going to keep beating until they get to a stiff peak, which is just like this. That's exactly what we're looking for. So let's get back to our chocolate. It's cooled a bit and we're going to add some really, really finely diced walnuts to the chocolate and just mix that in. And then we're going to add it to our stiffened egg whites and we're going to be folding this mixture together. Now folding is not the same as stirring. You kind of put your spatula down and kind of let the mixture fall onto itself. And notice I'm going right all the way around and down through the bottom. And we're looking to have the mixture end up sort of like this. There can be streaks of egg white in it, that's fine. And then we get our baking sheet ready with our parchment. I'm using my little cookie scoop today and I'm just gonna start scooping the cookies out onto the baking sheet. Now for this cookie, they're um, kind of small but you wanna leave a little room for them to puff up. So you should be able to get, oh, 12 to 14 cookies on a sheet. Then we put them in the oven at 350 degrees. They'll bake from about nine to 10 minutes and they'll come out looking like this, almost like cracked on the outside. But when you open these cookies up on the inside, you are gonna see this really moist, kind of brownie-like center. They're really, really good. If you'd like to try these delicious cookies, just go to our website and you'll find the recipe. Also, if you have any questions or ideas, send me an email. Thanks for watching.